Hare Krishna everyone, welcome to Salesforce Helping Hand channel. My name is Al Prajapati and today we will understand what is the audit trail in Salesforce. So as you know, field history is one of the feature, right, which used to track the fields uh, changes, you know, whatever you are making. But same way, if we need to check the organization level uh, changes or things, then how we will do, we will use the audit trail. So, audit trail basically track the administrative changes, right? For example, modification for user permission, data imports, configuration changes, right? So, what you need to do, you just can go to the setup and try to find the audit trail, right? So, audit trail is very important concept uh, when we talk about the, you know, to track the admin level tracking, comprehensive and uh, retention period accessibility right so these all things make uh, what i can say a very important concept as an audit trail right whom you need to give the you know admin access what are the access level they should have or by mistaken you have given it that it got identify in the audit trail so this really help how it help let's understand admin level tracking so this capture changes the admin level meaning changes to org setting profiles, roles, and more can be tracked. Comprehensive means like field history tracking. So audit trail also log who made the changes and what changes was made and when it was made, right? Third one is retention period. The setup audit trail display the last 20 or so changes made in the org. However, it retails data the last six months, right? accessible by downloading the CSV file you can check in like in last six months what are the changes made by some user on you know profile users right you know such and such settings now let's understand the accessibility so no configuration steps are needed here what you need to do you need to go to the audit trail can be accessed through the setup menu making it very easy for admin to review the most recent changes okay you can just easily found now let's understand what are the business case for it. So most of the business use the security as most things done by setup by affected larger group user or even the entire org. So monitoring the type of changes ensure that your org remain the secure. For example, if delegated admin accidentally grant uh, elevated permission to a group of user, the audit trail can quickly help identify who made the changes and when making it easy, you know, to correct the swiftly before potential security breach occurs right so this also uh, what i can say prove 